What's up you guys? Good morning and welcome back to our dumpster diving channel. Alex and I are out behind some retail shops right now. So we're gonna check their trash, see what they've thrown away and see if we can rescue any usable items from the landfill. All right, we're at the first one. Eggs. Some eggs, okay. That might mean, is this a restaurant? Yes, it's a noodle restaurant. First spot of the day is a restaurant. We've been trying to go to new dumpsters that we don't frequent very often, even though this is like the same city we normally dive in. We're trying some new spots. So let's see about this one. This, wow, is a pet store and they opened all the bags all up. Of them. As you can tell, there's like just a ton of dog food. Seven or eight bags. Yeah, there's some good brands in here, and you can see the kibbles just in the dumpster. Oh, there's a shattered aquarium. Mm -hmm. Wow, look at all that dog food. Look at that, y'all. That's sad. Bummer, nothing there. I hate that pet stores do that. It's very common, we see it a lot. Um, other divers see it a lot at pet stores where they've ripped the food bags open. It's just disappointing when it could be donated to a shelter um, or discounted in the store. All right, what about this one? <laughs> Empty. <laughs> Restaurant dumpster. Oh, look at all this potato. What is this? <laughs> Do you see all those potatoes? potatoes? Yeah, this is definitely a restaurant. Yeah. Definitely restaurant material. Definitely. Darn. Okay, maybe this one? Yeah, let's check it. Here we go. <laughs> We're walking. We're walking. There's a couple walking dumpster divers. Yeah, we're gonna walk in. Okay, what about this one? Ew. Oh, disappointing. Interesting dumpster though. Yeah, it's um different style. It's like a big igloo cooler or something. It's plastic. Huh. Probably easier to lift. Yeah. Better for the trucks or something. Well, it is a frigid morning, isn't it? I know. It's like a lot colder than I was expecting. Yes, me too. We're out here though. We're doing our best. Let's see what else we find. All right, let's see what we've got. Okay, this is the yogurt story. I can tell from the cups. Um, okay, that's more frozen yogurt stuff, okay. This is more food bags. That says hot dorts. <laughs> it says hot dorts. Is that what you were trying to get? Let's see what's in there. Oh, there's a couple hot dorts in there. Let me see. Oh, look, that's funny. It's hot Doritos. <laughs> How weird. Yogurt. <laughs> All right, mostly yogurt stuff. Okay. Just yeah, that's about it. All right, y'all, we're moving on. All right, new spot. Let's see. Is this a Dunkaroo? Was I right? No, this is adorable. <laughs> It's adorable. Hey! There we go. Oh, that's got more cords and stuff in it. Maybe I just set it right there. These have a little mic. They might work for our Xbox. That's probably See? up there. Yeah, there's the box. Oh, cool. I don't know what this is. Full bag. Huh, like a little shoe holder for the closet or something? <laughs> I, oh yeah, I have these current stickers on my phone case. <laughs> oh, nice. I found them before. 
I didn't know it came with a finger uh, board. That's cool. Oh yeah, that's a pretty good one. Oh, uh, it's... Oh darn, it's got a big hole. Alright, toss that back. And what was in this bag? Oh look, here's a part of... Another part of that thing. Okay. I saw that back there. Okay, oh look at this! It's a glove with a Velcro ball, so it always catches. <laughs> oh, that's cute. That's a little, whoops, a little Hello Kitty keychain. She's floating in there. straws I think. They're plastic in there. That's great. Okay. Not bad. Let's see if Alex is finding anything. Not quite. I kind of found a little uh, St. Patrick's Day hat oh. but it was like in a bag soaked with booze. Oh. <laughs> nice. Alright. There we go. Nothing else but a nice little thing right here. <laughs> oh, I can use your crate you found. Really? There we go. Look at this. What? The other side of the crate says, use warning, use by other than registered owner. <laughs> oh, you guys were going to jail. That's funny. Use by other than registered owner. <laughs> oh, no. You guys don't tell anyone we're using it to hold our fines. <laughs> okay, y'all, what do we have? Oh, what's this? Is that a thing? It's like there's kind of stuff. Oh, that really? I, so it's like I, I mean, I don't know for sure, but. Let's check. Oh. <laughs> What's that? I grabbed this and then I can't tell. It's like back to the thing. Huh? Estee Lauder. I think. Wires. Oh, yeah. What about that pink plastic thing? Oh. <laughs> That's full. But what is it? It looks so old. Like it's see that fall up brow wax? Yeah, that's, see? That's what I'm doing to my brows. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> Before and wow. <laughs> Before and wow. I just want to open this and see what this is. You've been using them. Yeah. Okay, leave those. What's this box right there? This one? No, that box has like. Oh, those are empty. And that's a bag of possible. Is this like, is this what people go through and then they find all the stuff? Yeah, because, yeah. But see how, oh, this is so messy. <laughs> that's gross. <laughs> so these are called suit bags. Uh, when you're at this makeup store, they pour all of like this foundation and lotion in the bag so that even though there's usable items in here, it's really impossible to get them out. Um, some divers who are extremely dedicated do it. Um, I, we really don't. <laughs> it's like, it's so much. All right, well, we'll be leaving that. All right, nothing there. We like to check that one. We rarely find things, but it's a good one sometimes to check. And we're moving on. <laughs> I know, it's pretty far.
well. We checked the dumpsters behind this whole shopping division. We have not found anything yet, but we're gonna keep going. All right, y'all, we are at a new dumpster. Let's see, lots of boxes. Oh, that's a huge box in there. I actually think it's all the way boxes. Hold on, there's something in this thing. Oh yeah, there's something in here. Oh, that's big one? Yeah. I bet it's a broken mirror or something, but we could try to see. Oh wow. Oh, it's a nice standing mirror. It's two of them. Oh. Shattered. Yeah. An easel mirror. <laughs> Here, how much did it say it was? One twenty-nine. Yeah. Oh, it's it's pretty. Nice. It is nice. Well. It's unfortunate. Yeah, I wish one of them was still intact. That would be cool. Yeah. Here, we should. Once we're done, we should. Okay, yeah, I get the mirror everywhere. Okay. All right, here, let's lay this one in there. Here we go. Uh, that's unfortunate. I know, that would have been pretty in our house. <laughs> well, you wanna check this one? I think that they have two. Let's see. And this is even more boxes in here. Okay, there's only one box that looks like it could still be sealed. Oh, no. I see that the top's been cut off of it, so it just has other boxes in the top. Darn. Okay. Well, nothing there. Nothing here. Pick up a little bit of weird trash. There we go. <laughs> Got some cardboards. <laughs> they have a compactor and two dumpsters and not a single recycling bin. <laughs> yeah. It's because they want to be able to throw away big broken mirrors. Yeah. It's true. That's what I just threw in. <laughs> I was like, what is it? It looks like some like toy wizard wand or something. <laughs> All right, we are going to the next spot. All right, new dumpster. <laughs> Not much anything, huh? <laughs> like, food. Yeah. Okay. Nothing there. There is this giant roll away dumpster behind me. I don't know if y'all can see it, but that is where we're headed. Oh. It does look mainly like construction. Nothing that isn't <coughs> just it's just construction trash. Yeah. Oh, yeah, look at that. A lot of trash. Alright. Alright, let's see. Do we have anything? Oof, no. This is not the dumpster that I thought it was then. That's restaurant stuff. And I thought this was a children's boutique. <laughs> so, okay. I was expecting clothing. That was just like onion skins. So we're moving on. Okay. Ooh. Uh, 
weird. Yeah, I'm curious what's in that box over there. Yeah, it could be something. Let's see. for garage sales. You could put all your like 25 cent items. Oh yeah. You know. I wonder where it came from. One of these stores. Oh, yeah. Ooh. A lot of boxes. Yeah. But I recognize this stuff from yesterday. Let's see. Uh, <laughs> I don't think so. All right, Alex is digging more in that one. I am gonna check this one. Oh, it's bright. Let's see. This one's empty. All right. Here's this cool thing that I was saying would be great for a garage sale. Look at that! It's a T.Y. heart. How funny. I broke it in half. Now this honestly, it clearly, it clearly used to have T.Y. Beanie Babies in it. That's funny. If I knew for sure this was trash, I would take it, but there it is, and no, it's really close to their business. It's right up against it. It is not in the dumpster, so I'm gonna leave it. Ooh, what'd you find? I don't know. <laughs> don't hit me with the grabber. Oh my gosh. Wow. You found some like very, it reflects in the sunlight nicely. <laughs> Dude, what have you done? What have you done? It's like a good crafter supply. Yeah, it could get rolled up and like bundled together and it'd be, yeah. it's kind of interesting. Take it from the yep, save it from the landfill. Someone could do something cool with it. There we go, if I could, <laughs> it is hard to handle. Yeah, I like to show Shattered. it. Yeah, it's like a little creamer dish or something. Broken. Okay. That's everything. Wait. There might be the pile. Oh, what's in here? Where that lucky charm thing is. This? Yeah. Hat, but we'll leave this. 
There it goes, for someone else. <laughs> All right, well, uh, so far today we have found a couple of items. We got our stuff from Five Below. These little things that, not sure what they are, but they might go in your closet. And uh, there's our little tiny pile right there. <laughs> We're still going though. Wish us luck and maybe we will find something before the morning is over. New dumpster, let's see. A bunch of receipts in that bag. Wow, that is a lot of receipts. Take it. <laughs> Look at that whole receipts too. Some of them got drinks. Drinks in it. Do uh, you want it? Uh, pull it out. I'll pick out a couple. Sure. Okay. <laughs> Do it in the truck bed, and I'll. Uh... We're at the point where we're actually just taking trash out of the dumpsters. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Look at that. Here's our haul, you guys. <laughs> it's like just trash. Okay. Wow, Alex checks um, the other dumpster behind me. I am gonna pull out a couple of these receipts. This really is just a huge bag of receipts. And I told y'all about the Fetch app um, and I don't know what their points are for alcohol, but all of these are just like people's liquor shopping lists. So I'm just gonna take a couple and see what happens. Hooky. Dumpster diving. Let's see. What do we have in here? Mm. Balloon. Same old, same old. Mm. <laughs> Gross cup, never mind. That's just... <laughs> just trash. Should we take one? <laughs> Here I guess, we'll All just right. start taking bags out of dumpsters and we take them directly to the landfill ourselves. <laughs> okay, that sounds great. All right, let's go. <laughs> you guys, we are not having the best of luck today, but we uh, have several more spots to go. So we have more opportunities to find stuff. So let's go see. All right, y'all, we're at the bowling alley. <laughs> And we're gonna check this dumpster, but I also wanted to show y'all these really nice flowers here popping up. Very nice. It is turning into spring. And let's see. Oh, so they do have a, tr they are open. Like this is their concession stuff. Yeah, they're open. Huh, check this side. <laughs> Oh, food. Yuck. Okay. Let's see what other oh. <laughs> trash they're gonna have. Yeah, I'm curious about that too. Maybe put him on the windshield. The truck's so dirty it won't stick. Yeah, he won't stick. Darn. So in there, it looks like just all concession stand trash. It looks like the food that they serve here. But we've been curious about what would a bowling alley throw away. One time they had this big hallway dumpster and we found a bunch of chairs um, in it. And so we've just always been kind of curious since then, what do they throw away? Today is kind of gross trash, but maybe in the future it would be like bowling pins or balls or shoes. We're just kind of curious. So we'll keep checking it. Uh, nothing though today. So we're going to the next spot. All right, well, we just got to the mall. Let me turn the truck off, actually. We come here all the time to dive. It never looks like this. Right now, there's trash overflowing, and it actually looks like a diver like went through these bags and did this. Obviously, we don't know for certain, but the way that all of the bags are ripped open um, and that there's just stuff falling out of them everywhere, it looks like they now you picked out a couple candles here 
and this is the mess that they left. So we're huge advocates for leaving it cleaner than you found it. Um, the only way that we can continue dumpster diving is if we stay out of sight of the stores and we don't cause these big messes. We don't create reasons for them to lock the dumpsters or switch to compactors. If you're a diver and you see something like this, you don't have to pick it up, but you can try and do a little bit for your part or at least just don't leave it looking like this. Now that I'm back here, this couldn't possibly be a dumpster dive. We're doing all of this. This is the stores being over full, overflowing with their trash as well. This box, I think I'll look through because this is like a little plant. Uh, it's pretty broken. It's too much stuff. Yeah, it's crazy. Like all, have you seen back here? It can't be just a diver, but it is. Yeah, all right. Well, regardless if it was a diver or the store, um, we can take a little opportunity to clean it up. So that's what we're gonna do. dustpan over there. It works great. <laughs> look a little bit better there's too much trash in the dumpster to fill it we didn't even mess with the stuff back there but here we go it's just a good way to do your part one time we got stopped by a cop when we were dumpster diving and in our area it's not illegal so he said it's no problem um, that we could keep going that the only time it became illegal is when uh, you, if we made a big mess, if we started pulling a bunch of stuff out of the trash, it would become illegal, not for the diving purpose, but for the littering side of it. So if you're dumpster diving, if it's legal in your city, that's awesome. Um, but make sure that you're picking up after yourself. Don't cause a big mess. On really windy days, this weekend has been so windy. On really windy days, uh, trash just gets blown everywhere. And so that's why a lot of times if things are too full, if they're just piled high in the dumpster, we won't always look because it's better to not look than to pull it all down accidentally uh, or let the wind just blow it all around. So, okay, so there we go. Uh, we didn't find anything at the mall, but we got to help uh, tidy up a little bit. So that's awesome, y'all. We are moving on. Here, will you grab this grabber? All right, still at the mall here. Let's see. Some lawn chickens. Oh, another giant poster. I think it was a roll, and that's the end of the roll. Mm, it's hard to see it. Oh, that's their pastries and stuff. Okay. Trash. Uh, yeah. All right, it's the recycling. Just boxes that I see. Okay, well, there we go. <laughs> I guess, I guess we're moving on. <laughs> I know. All right, let's see. Wow. 
see what Alex thinks. <laughs> yeah. Man, rough day indeed. You know, you come out here, you try your best. You don't always find stuff. But hopefully that means that there are less usable items going to the landfill. Not that we're just completely missing all of them. Whoa, chest freezer. <laughs> Another Christmas tree. <laughs> oh, another Christmas tree. We have so many fake Christmas trees. Oh, uh, we do. Big. Little, uh, mm -hmm. Cold plunge. Yeah, do your little tank. There's no way that works. No. <laughs> no. It's like hundreds of years old. <laughs> <laughs> what about. There it is. It didn't know. <laughs> <laughs> it didn't really mean to do all that. Okay. All right. Well, one very old chest freezer. Oh my gosh, look how flat my tire is. I bet you hit something. Okay. Has it always been that flat? I don't think it's always been that flat. Huh, maybe it has. Yeah. Well, okay. Huh, my tire looks really low. I either didn't notice that um, or we hit something. We have, driving around like where the dumpsters are is like where the uh, knives, what gets stuck? <laughs> the knives, what gets stuck? Yeah. The nails, I where the nails would be too. So maybe we have a knife in our tire, um, but okay, we'll, we'll keep going. Despite all our hardships, we're gonna keep going. Okay, we're gonna check this one last dumpster and then we'll go home since we don't want to get a flat tire out here. This will be the last stop. I'm gonna flip this over. An old mop. No, I don't see anything under there. Yikes. Dang. All right, let's flip this back. Here, can you catch it? I didn't want to make a big loud sound. Okay, well, <laughs> what a day, you know? What a day. We have our little items back here. Still nothing new from maybe like our third stop of the whole day. Uh, so very, very small haul today, but it's always fun to come out. Uh, we hope you guys really enjoyed watching this video and just tagging along with us, even though it's not the most exciting when we have small hauls. I always say it's just a reality of dumpster diving. You don't always find things when you go out. Some days, like yesterday we went out, we found so much stuff. Today we go out, we don't find anything. So, you know, it's hit or miss, but it's a part of dumpster diving and we had a lot of fun today. So thank you guys so much for watching. We hope you have a really great day and we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.